I'm here with Christian, and we're going to be talking about the state meet. How do you think the team performed at the state uh, cross-country meet? Uh, I think both teams, boys and girls, performed uh, best we've probably performed all season. Uh, we had a bunch of guys and girls uh, set personal records, so it's definitely an improvement from what they did last year. Uh, how do you think um, you alls success from this year can project for next year? Um, I think next year we have a chance to improve from fifth place finish at state with uh, all the guys returning except for one. Tyler Cobb is our number four. He'll be graduating this year. But all the other guys, we're going to be improving throughout the season, so hopefully that will result in a better finish this year, next year at state. I'm here with Jasmine, and we're going to be talking about the state cross-country meet. How do you think the team performed at the state meet? Um, we performed really good. We each ran our personal best times at the state course. And uh, how do you feel about your success through the years, through your high school career, and how y'all grew as a team? Well, um, the senior class, we've been together for five years, and we've helped each other, pushed each other through workouts, and finishing second, um, I mean, we've worked hard for it, so we've done good. with Ryan Gensel and Anthony Berry talking about the first round of the playoffs. How did y'all do? Uh, we did really good against a tough component. Liberty Island is always a, a hard game, and uh, they always come and play to their best ability, and everybody stepped up. Uh, how do y who do you think the key players are? Uh, I think that uh, when you when you have a team, a team sport like football, there's really, no, there's really no key players. It's just like a team effort most of the time, and that's how we feel like we, we did as a team. That's good. Uh, one of y'all's big plays of the game? Uh, at the very beginning, when Jordan Fuentes had a fumble recovered, and uh, that started us our offensive uh, series off right. And then in uh, the middle of the game, when Kelvin Kirsch threw a touchdown to uh, Drake Cox, even though it looked like a duck. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and like defense had a lot of key plays that uh, led the offense into a scoring drive. That's good. How do y'all feel about the second round? Uh, we're playing Midlothian Heritage in Ennis on Friday, and we feel like it's a, it's a doable game if we'll go out there and do our job and execute like we're supposed to, for sure. We'll okay. win the game. Good job. Be there. <laughs> I'm here with Jake Howe, Casey, Brittany Taylor, Jasmine Mouse, Mason Lambeth, Alfredo Landa. I'm here with Mr. Feller. I'm going to ask a couple questions. First one is What does ATM stand for? ATM. The, you know how you take money out? At the moment. Um, account transaction. I don't know what the M is. Uh, at A and M. I don't know. I have no clue. No. Automatic teller machine. Second question: What countries make up North America? <laughs> North America. That'd be the U.S., United States, so, yeah. Uh, United States, Canada, Mexico. <laughs> what countries make up North America? Canada and the United States. What countries make up North America? None. I still don't know. What goes up whenever it goes down? I'm not certain on that one. What goes up, but never goes down? I wish it was my bank account. <laughs> <laughs> I'm thankful for my friends and family. I'm thankful for my friends and family. <laughs> and Jordan Flintes. I'm thankful for food. I'm thankful for my mom, because she does my laundry, she cleans my room. She buys me things. Um, I'm thankful for having everybody there that who's helped me through the roughest times, and I'm. Th I'm thankful for family, friends, and just being alive. I'm thankful for my family. I'm thankful for my mullet looking nice every day. I, I'm thankful for Jesus because He has my back. He's always there for me. I'm thankful for every day I wake up. I'm thankful for everyone fighting for our country. My name is Marquita Johnson, and um, I'm thankful for God waking me up this morning and um, giving me another opportunity to play football.